Hello and welcome to a video from Bosch Rexroth. In this video I would like to give you more information, and show you useful links about Control x automation. The most important anchor point for all aspects is the micro website. www.controlx-automation.com Here you will find all kinds of information and links to the entire automation system. For technical users programmers and developers. The Control X automation community is certainly the most important and helpful area. It can be accessed here or via the URL www.controlx-automation.com slash community or at the top in the site header. Let me start it clicking on the direct link. You can search for information directly in the community or you can start a sub area. The store gives you access to the apps from Bosch Rexroth and Control X World Partners. Find very useful tips and videos in the how to area. In the forum area, you can ask questions and benefit from the experiences of others, etc. The device portal is used to securely manage Control X hardware, apps, licenses, and more. Click the arrow to show further areas. Under DOC, Find the latest documentation for online viewing and for downloading. We cover the online configurator later in this video. You can quickly generate electrical drawing details in the file format ePlan star.edz and as star.pdf. Software developers can find repositories and packages from Bosch Rexroth under GitHub. In the getting started section you will find further information about the content and how to interact with the community. But to be able to use all the options, login or register beforehand. Login is done via the Bosch single key ID, which can also be used for many other Bosch wide services. You can also see whether you are logged in or not by the red dot at the top of my Rexroth. Let me say something about the deployment of Control X automation software releases. To do this, please enter release cycle in the search line and select the appropriate result. As you can see in the table, there are two types and times for releases. Firstly, the LTS releases. LTS stands for long-term support. Once a year at the end of July a new open sales release is published. This is maintained for years. And receives service packs with bug fixes and security updates as required. LTS releases are available in the store. Secondly, on the way to a new LTS release. There are the so-called early adopter releases. These are released every three months, in summer, fall, and spring. They are used to test new functions in pre-series applications, and then result in a new LTS release. Early adopter releases are only available after special approval in the collaboration room. This process has already been shown in another video. Let me take a look inside the store. Here you will find a large selection of apps from Bosch Rexroth and the Control X World Partners. You can search, filter, sort and change the view to find the right app for you. An extremely useful section for beginners and advanced users is the How To section. Here you will find technical instructions and know-how from users for users. The search and filter functions already mentioned are also available here. The pinned collection of how-to videos, blogs and examples for Control X automation offers are a great place to start. Another important area for every user with questions and looking for answers is the forum area. 
Every user can read in the forum, search for specific content using keywords or simply browse. To be able to ask questions in the forums you must be logged into the community. Within the existing sub forums you can search even more directly, for example, in the Control X Motion Forum. Otherwise, the forum works as you are used to from other forums. In addition to the forums with Bosch Rexroth products and solutions, there are also forums of the Control X World Partners. This means that the partners not only contribute their apps and solutions, but also offer direct contact for questions relating to their areas of application. Use the web-based Control X configurator to put your desired automation components together, step by step to create a solution. You can either start a new project or continue working on a project that has already been saved. To create a new project, click on the button on the left. You will also need to be logged in for this. You can then start directly with the graphically supported configuration. This configuration process is supported by further selection and adaptation to the respective valid specifications. In the how-to section of the Control X community, you will also find tips for optimal use of the Control X configurator. That is what I wanted to show you. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this was helpful for you. Register and benefit from all the resources available in the Control X community. Enjoy Control X automation and be two steps ahead.